Here we go. Time to play as a warlock. This one goes out to Mione, Rockstar, McGillicuddy. Check it out, man. Just for you. Ace logo pop. All right, it's going to be the first time I've ever played as a warlock. We're going to go ahead and play against a mage, since I know Mione loves the second favorite class in the game is mages next to warlocks. I'm going to take a look at the deck. Uh, the crux of the, the, the deck's playstyle is, is a bit different than everyone else. Uh, it's, its hero is actually detrimental to its own survivability, but allows it to draw cards at a faster rate. So the uh, I think the, the, the goal as a warlock is kind of push the ticket, you know what I mean? Like get cards out on the field fast. Well, unfortunately, this is literally the first time I've ever played as a warlock. So it's probably going to be quite bad. But anyway, we get a time card down immediately. Look at that. End of turn. Jane of Problem was like, what the fuck? How you get to that card already? And I'm like, nah, that's fucking that's it. So really important to have taunts. I really, you know, I don't really know how much that type of thing plays into a Warlock's deck, but what I've seen other Warlocks do is a series of cards that essentially like a massive, massive boost to their one of their cards for one turn and then the card dies. Uh, also, let's see, what was some of the other ones? Like it, it enhances a demon. It's summoning demons, stuff like that. So, unfortunately, the starter deck that you get, none of that shit's in here. But I mean, we're gonna we're gonna make it happen. We're gonna make it happen just for me, honey. Now the mage's ability is fire blast. That can be used pretty tactically. There's a few different cards that really synergize well with it. Oh, uh, well, here's the void walker, fucking blueberry. Let's get him out. Come on out, buddy. We're gonna get look at all these commies. Bitch ain't gonna be attacked. Shit, she's gonna have to attack. Oh, she attacked for that. But anyway, here we go. First, first time warlock. You know what I mean? Try to keep exciting. That guy's sending out a warg, and that thing's dead. Look at that. Just way too strong. We're gonna deal two damage and restore that kind of. No, we're not gonna do that right now. Uh, we're actually gonna do this. We're gonna send. Yeah, look at that. That is just two very high skill play right there. Dealing two damage. Now we're gonna deal one damage to major dealing. Already down five health. Meanwhile, I'm only down one and I'm a warlock. Haven't really used this yet. I'm not really sure. I guess maybe if I was like really struggling to get cards on the field. Look at that. Four damage to a minion. That's just unreal damage. We're gonna do that damage. Right now. Unreal damage. Really loud animation though. Not really sure what that was about. And then we're gonna just finish it off right now. Let's just get this card out of here. And we're gonna go for it. Actually, let's do this. I wanna see what happens here. Oh, Ogre Magi. That's pretty useful. I really don't like sacrificing health, though. It's not my favorite concept. Typically, uh, I've been playing Priest as well. That'll probably be out at some point, but the Paladin one's next. Uh, that's my favorite deck so far. I really like the whole, like, bide your time type style where you can heal yourself up a lot and then wait for the right combo of cards to come out. Unfortunately, if it doesn't come out properly, then you're fucked. You might as well just uninstall the game because we have no shot of winning. Uh, but luckily, you know, the games I have won, I've done really well with. Um, and the games I've lost, I've like, really, really, really lost them. Right, so. Unfortunately, the computer AI doesn't offer uh, you know, a, a, a robust challenge. But uh, managed to still at least show off the basics here. Now, as I said, it's very, very much about... The Warlock specific cards, which include this, the Succubus, Drain Life, stuff like that. Uh, actually, let's go ahead and do that right now. Yeah, that's a fucking crazy animation. Might be a bit too loud, but that's we don't we don't care about that. Draw another card. Let's go. Oh, that's a good card right there. We're gonna put that one down. Discard one. Oh, get rid of the fucking gorilla. Peace out. You know what I mean? Don't even need the gorilla. Just get rid of it. And in the turn right now, the mage is really reeling. At this point, she's considering teleporting back to Dalaran. But, you know, we'll, we'll leave that type of non-canon stuff out. Also, if you weren't aware, you could, like, play with the train. Look at that. Broken glass. Okay, okay. Broken glass. Ring the bell. You can shut the door. Fuck with the sign. You can mess around with the hay. The griffin's there. Tick the clock. Look at that. You fuck with the water pail. It's pretty cool, man. Really, really cool stuff. Destroy one of your mana crystals. Now this seems like a pretty... Look at the fell guard. This is actually a card I got in a pack, and I got pretty lucky to get it, so I figured I might as well use it. Not sure how it actually works. Yes, you actually lose one of the mana crystals. If you're not aware, you gain a mana crystal each turn. That's a pretty interesting... <laughs> That's an interesting card. There's no fucking doubt about that. Not necessarily the coolest thing ever, but... 
It is pretty neat. Felga. It looks awesome as well, doesn't it? Anyway, we're, we're rocking here. We're hitting her hard. She just has no answer for my pure warlock badassness. You know what I mean? Like, this is what it's all about. Uh, the only thing I'm missing is the green fire. But at this point, I really don't need it. You know what I mean? That's for noobs anyway. The green fire is really easy. Just another proof that, you know... Actually, it's too hard, actually. is what I meant to say. It's not too easy. Way too hard. Games for kids, you can tell. Guild Wars doesn't have stupid stuff like that. You can tell they really tell, tell them. You know, they, they really care about their community. They don't have dumb shit like that, like the Green Fire Quest. But that's not in this game. Uh, so no need to worry. But this guy's going to be a big issue, isn't he? Boulder Fist Ogre. Just smacking my shit around. But, oh, Polymorph. Now that's not good because that's a really high synergy with this ability. But fuck it, she doesn't even give a shit. Let's go ahead and attack. Oh, we gotta get a taunt down. This is probably a good time to get another card out. Oh, brilliant. Built brilliant draw. Absolutely. Just pro draw. I mean, at this point, she is really considering the Hearthstone back to Dar. It's not, not really, probably, actually anymore, because she's fucking never rocking know me, what <laughs> Taunt is so OP, I have to say that. That's one thing that really cannot go unsaid. Like, that card is essentially stopping me from winning this game. But she has gotten a lot of abilities out there, and it's not, or a lot of minions out there, and it's really not conducive to a win, unfortunately. For I just have nothing I can play. I feel like sacrificing health at this point is just not a good idea, but I need to get these cards off the deck, and I just can't do it. Shooting arcane missiles. What do you think? It's fucking wrath. Nobody uses that ability. Oh, okay. Well, okay. Foolish enough to get rid of that. So now all I need to do is actually... I'm going to end up losing. Yeah, I've definitely lost this. See how quick it could turn. Really, really, really silly. I probably wasted a lot of health. Oh, this might actually save me. Let's see. Two health. Now first we do this. You got to play this smart now here. Get this guy in the deck. Remain. This might actually work out here. So now it's going to deal 3 damage and restore 3 health. Alright, getting rid of this card. Oh, it's only going to restore 2 health. Are you serious? Anyway. Uh, I should survive? Yeah, I'll survive easily. As long as he uh, wipe out all my cards, I think I'll win, actually. We'll see very shortly, or won't we? Oh no, that could be... Uh, luckily he attacked. No, it's gonna be a tough ending. It's gonna be a tough ending. I only have three health left, and I essentially have nothing. Now this could actually come into come into play pretty well. Eh? I'm gonna heal myself up. I'm gonna take the risk. Taking two extra damage. Oh, look at this. Pro combo. But that's not unfortunate. That's probably where it ends. I'll give it a shot. I don't really have anything here at this point. And she does have the ability to do five damage to me, so. That is the end of the game, unfortunately, unless the AI makes a, a grievous error. But I don't believe it's going to. No, it's not. So very, very close match. First game ever as a warlock. You could tell already on my way to 2.9.5k rated. Uh, almost gaining the level there. Oh, actually am gaining the level there. That's interesting. So, let's see what we get. We get Corruption. Choose an enemy minion at the start of your turn. Destroy it. That sounds like a fucking terrible card. Why the hell? Oh, enemy minion. Of course, of course. Pretty good card. Have to add that to the deck. Anyway, uh, while you're leveling 1 to 10, there's 20 levels. 1 to 10 of the deck, you gain a new card every f two levels. Uh, so, that was the first time I've ever got one. Obviously, gotten uh, level 2 with the Warlock, but... If you have any questions, uh, the Paladin will be live also at some point. Um, and then after that, I think I'll do a, a game with the Priest. If you have any questions, let me know. Uh, if you want to, once again, completely, completely cool with doing any type of request content. So, you know, I have the beta, but it's more like we all have the beta. You just tell me what you want to see, and I will do a fucking video on it, no matter what it is. All right, as long as it's not sexually explicit conduct, you know. So, yeah.